Usually you find here car news, comparison and analysis type videos. But this session is different, explanation type. The topic is body and frame and monocoque chassis. Let's quickly start. But before proceeding forward, let me remind you to subscribe this channel and like this video because I bring here interesting automobile content. Body and frame and monocoque. These are actually construction type. In a car making process, first a metal structure is made. The structure is called chassis, on which other body parts such as engine, suspension, interior panels all are fitted. Let's start from body on frame. This is the oldest and original way of construction. Here a separate chassis is made where the powertrain components such as engine, suspension, drivetrain, wheel, steering are mounted. This structure looks like a ladder. So the body on frame chassis is also known as ladder frame chassis. After this, a separate body containing interior, seat, body panels, etc. are bolted on this frame. All All the heavy vehicles like big SUVs, pickups, trucks, etc. are based on body on frame chassis. Body on frame vehicles are more durable. They are often robust. They can withstand better in off-roads. They have high payload and towing capacities. They can sustain torsional twist. That's make body and frame vehicles more suitable for off-roading. As the powertrain and body are separately bolted, the NVH level is also low in body and frame vehicles. From manufacturer's point of view, the body and frame vehicles are easy to develop, easy to repair, and modular means a number of different products of different body type can be made with simple tweaks. The disadvantages of body on frame vehicles are they are heavy and their fuel consumption is high. Hope you understood body on frame. Now let's come to monocoque chassis. Using high strength steel, advanced welding techniques and reinforcement, a rigid car body is made. All other components like engine, suspension, wheels, interior, seats all are mounted on the chassis. This type of construction of chassis is called monocoque chassis. The chassis are designed in such a way that they can sustain all stress from engine and suspension. There is no separate powertrain part is required. All things are integrated to the main chassis. That's why monocoque construction are also known as unibody construction. All car, van, crossover are based on monocoque chassis. The monocoque chassis are lightweight. Due to lightweight, they offer better fuel efficiency. The driving dynamics are also good in monocoque vehicles. It offers better handling and stability due to its lower center of mass. For a manufacturer, these monocoque chassis are manufacturing efficient. The disadvantages are low towing and off-road capacity, complex design, and these are costly to develop. Some examples of Indian monocoque cars are Creta, Safari, XUV700, Volkswagen Vartjas, Skoda Kusak, etc. And some examples of body and frame vehicles are Bolero, Scorpio, Fortuner, Pickup, etc. But still, there are some exceptions like Land Rover Defender and this bus from Porsche Motors. Despite of being monocoque, they offer better off-road and payload capacity. So hope you understood monocoque and body and frame well. Hope this was helpful for you. Thanks for watching. Subscribe this channel and like this video for such more interesting and informative videos.